What if the secret to happiness lies not in what you acquire, but in what you let go of? In our acquisitive society, we're often led to believe that more is better, more money, more possessions, more experiences. But what if we've got it all wrong? What if the path to true contentment is actually paved with less, not more? We'll be discussing the science behind happiness and how living a frugal, minimalist lifestyle could potentially increase our levels of joy and satisfaction. So prepare to challenge your preconceived notions about wealth and happiness. Join us as we delve into why frugal living is the secret to happiness. We often equate happiness with material possessions, don't we? It's a common belief that a bigger house, a newer car, or the latest tech gadget will bring us joy. We live in a society that thrives on consumerism, where success is often measured by how much we own. But is this the true path to happiness? Research suggests otherwise. Studies show that after meeting basic needs, additional wealth does little to increase our sense of well-being. The rush we feel when buying something new often fades quickly, leaving us in a cycle of wanting more. This is known as the hedonic treadmill, a pattern of chasing happiness through material gain, only to find it always just out of reach. So if happiness isn't about accumulating stuff, then what is it about? Could it be about appreciating what we already have? about savouring experiences over things, about meaningful relationships and purposeful living. What do we mean by frugal living? It's more than just saving money. It's a lifestyle that values simplicity and avoids excessive consumption. It's about making informed, thoughtful decisions about how we use our resources, whether it's time, money, or even energy. In our society, there's a common misconception that frugal living equals deprivation. This couldn't be further from the truth. Frugal living isn't about denying oneself life's pleasures, but rather about making conscious choices that align with our values and priorities. It's about finding joy in simplicity and making the most out of what we have. Minimalism, a close cousin to frugal living, also encourages us to focus on what truly matters by eliminating the unnecessary. It invites us to clear the clutter, not just in our homes, but also in our minds. But where's the evidence for this, you may ask? Well. Let's dive into the fascinating world of science. Multiple studies have shown that happiness isn't attached to the abundance of material possessions, but rather to the quality of experiences and relationships. In fact, research from San Francisco State University revealed that people who spent money on experiences rather than material items were significantly happier and felt their money was better spent. This is where minimalism comes into play. By focusing on the essentials, we can shift our attention from material possessions to experiences and relationships that truly enrich our lives. Moreover, a study published in the Journal of Positive Psychology found that people who practice minimalism report higher levels of happiness, suggesting a clear link between minimalistic lifestyle and emotional well-being. So, the next time you're faced with a choice between buying another gadget or spending quality time with loved ones, remember, Science indeed supports the notion that less can be more when it comes to happiness. Imagine a life free from financial stress. How would that make you feel? Let's delve into how such a life can be possible through the practice of frugal living. When we live frugally, we're not merely scrimping and saving. No, we're consciously choosing to live within our means, to prioritize needs over wants, to value quality over quantity. This lifestyle choice can lead to financial freedom. But what does financial freedom actually mean? It's not about amassing a mountain of wealth. It's about gaining control over your finances so that money-related worries don't dictate your life. This freedom can significantly reduce stress levels. Imagine not losing sleep over bills, debts, or unexpected expenses. Imagine being able to make choices based on what truly makes you happy, not what your bank account dictates. This is the power of financial freedom. This is the power of frugal living. Have you ever considered how frugal living might encourage gratitude? True enough, when we consciously decide to live with less, it's like we're handed a magnifying glass to truly see the value of what we already possess. This isn't about deprivation, but about appreciation. Imagine the simple joy of a home-cooked meal, the comfort of a well-worn sweater, or the satisfaction of a book well-read. These are the treasures of frugal living that we often take for granted in our pursuit of more. Frugality nudges us to pause, to appreciate the small yet significant pleasures that life generously offers. 
it's like a gentle reminder that happiness doesn't always come with a price tag. Moreover, this sense of gratitude can extend beyond our personal sphere. It can make us more aware of the efforts of others, the resources we consume, and the impact we have on our planet. Gratitude, it appears, is a natural byproduct of frugal living. But frugal living isn't just good for our wallets, it's good for our planet too. Frugal living encourages a lifestyle that reduces waste, values sustainability, and conserves resources. By choosing to live with less, we are also choosing to lessen our environmental footprint. This can be as simple as using a reusable water bottle, composting food scraps, or buying secondhand items. These small changes can make a significant impact on the environment. Moreover, living frugally allows us to appreciate what we have and reduce the demand for overproduction and overconsumption, which are major contributors to global environmental issues. And here's the beautiful part. Contributing to a healthier planet can also increase our happiness. It gives us a sense of purpose and fulfillment, knowing that our actions are helping to preserve the earth for future generations. Frugal living, then, is not only a path to personal happiness, but also to a healthier and happier planet. There's a certain peace of mind that comes with financial security, isn't there? Picture a life where you're not constantly worrying about the next bill, about how you're going to make ends meet. This is the joy of financial security, a joy that frugal living can bring. Frugal living is not about deprivation. It's about making smart choices. It's about prioritizing what truly matters to you and letting go of unnecessary expenses. With frugal living, you're not just saving money, you're buying freedom. Freedom from financial stress. Freedom to make choices based on what you want rather than what you can afford. Imagine waking up every morning knowing that you're financially secure, that you have a safety net to fall back on. That's a kind of joy that money simply can't buy. It's a joy that comes from peace of mind, from contentment, from knowing that you're living within your means and that you're in control of your financial future. Frugal living, it seems, can lead to a joy that money simply can't buy. Have you ever noticed how constraints can sometimes spark creativity? It's a fascinating phenomenon, isn't it? And it's precisely what frugal living can do for you. By cutting out the excess, the unnecessary, the distractions, you're left with a blank canvas, a space for your creativity to flourish. Frugal living isn't about deprivation. It's about making choices that align with your values. It's about choosing quality over quantity, experiences over possessions, simplicity over complexity. And in that space of conscious choice, creativity thrives. You start to see the world differently. You appreciate the beauty in the ordinary, find joy in the mundane. You learn to create rather than consume, to be resourceful and inventive. You discover that happiness doesn't come from what you have, but from what you do with what you have. Frugal living, then, can be a springboard for creativity and personal growth. Mindful spending, ever heard of it? It's a potent concept that can revolutionize your relationship with money and boost your overall happiness. Here's how it works. Rather than splurging on impulse purchases, mindful spending encourages you to pause, reflect, and ask yourself, do I really need this? Will it add value to my life? It's not about pinching pennies but rather making sure each cent goes towards something that genuinely enhances your life, something you cherish. It's a shift from mindless consumption to purposeful allocation of resources. You see, every purchase we make has a cost beyond the price tag. It's about time, energy and space as much as it is about money. By choosing to spend mindfully, we not only save money but also free up time and space for the things that truly matter to us. Frugal living can also have a profound social impact. By choosing to live frugally, we are choosing to consume less, which can contribute to social equality. It's a statement against the culture of consumerism that often widens the gap between the rich and the poor. Moreover, frugality encourages us to be more resourceful and share what we have with others. This can strengthen community bonds, as we find joy in giving and receiving rather than in hoarding and competing. Additionally, by living frugally, we can also inspire others to do the same. This ripple effect can lead to a more mindful society, one that values experiences over possessions and relationships over status. In a world where social issues are often linked to resource distribution, frugality can be a step towards a more equitable society. We can help bridge the gap, one frugal decision at a time. And let's not forget the impact of frugal living on our relationships. Living frugally isn't about depriving ourselves of joy, 
but rather about prioritizing what truly matters. This often includes the relationships we cherish most. By shifting our focus from material possessions to people, we start to invest more time and energy into building stronger, more meaningful connections. You see, when we stop trying to keep up with the Joneses, we free ourselves from the superficiality that often pervades our social circles. This doesn't mean we start shunning material goods entirely, but we start to see them for what they truly are, tools for living, not benchmarks for success. This perspective shift allows us to focus on the quality of our relationships, not the quantity of our possessions. Moreover, frugality can also foster a sense of community as we learn to share, swap and save together. It's a journey that brings us closer to those around us, promoting mutual understanding and empathy. In essence, frugal living is not just a financial decision. It's a lifestyle choice that can lead to a richer, more fulfilling life. So here's a thought. Perhaps the secret to happiness isn't in having more, but in needing less. Remember, the path to happiness may not be paved with gold, but with the joys of frugal living. Why not begin your journey today? Don't forget to like and subscribe for more valuable content like this.